You know, it's just our heat emissions that are hidden, right? They could look out a window and see us coming. Windows are structural weaknesses. Geth, do not use them. Approach the hull in these coordinates. Access achieved. We may proceed. network and fill the data storage with random bits. And that helps us how? The heretics must scrub this junk data. They have partitioned themselves into local networks working in parallel. Any alarm we trigger will not go beyond the room we are in. Only accessing the main core will trigger a station-wide alert. We've got a job to do. Let's get to it. Shepard Commander, we concluded that destruction of the station was the only resolution to the heretic question. There is now a second option. Their virus can be repurposed. If released into the station's network, the heretics will be rewritten to accept our truth. Either way, these Geth won't be a problem anymore. But Shepard, think about this. If you rewrite these Geth, they'll join the others. Legion's Geth will be stronger. Can we trust them not to attack us in the future? They're your people, Legion. You must have an opinion. This is new data. We have not yet reached consensus. We will process as the mission proceeds. Why didn't you mention this before we came aboard? We did not know the virus was complete. It is. It can be used against the true Geth at any time. Our arrival was timely. If this were an organic race, it might be an ethical problem. Geth aren't like organic life. Don't apply our morality to them. That is logical. You agree with that? No two species are identical. All must be judged on their own merits. Treating every species like one's own is racist even benign anthropomorphism. The minds of both forms of life can be shamed. Organics require time and effort. This is a the requirement. Change weapons! The get are inactive. Maybe we can sneak past them. The districts will alert local network. The government will bring the against hardware problems. attached to these hubs. These are mobile platforms. 
hardware. The crew is software. They are communing through the station's central computer. I'm not sure I follow. The heretics connect to the main computer to exchange data memories and program updates. We gain complexity by linking together. To be isolated within a single platform is to be reduced. We see less, comprehend less. It is quieter. If you exchange data, memories, how do you keep track of which ones are yours? How do you stay you? There is only we. We were created to share data among ourselves. The difference between Geth is perspective. We are many eyes looking at the same things. One platform will see things another does not, and will make different judgments. If that's the case, is rewriting the heretics that big a deal? They're like a rogue limb of your own body. Rewriting them would be like reattaching a severed arm. To use your metaphor, they removed themselves from our body, took their perspective, their judgment. They decided to worship Sovereign. I don't think you're missing much. Every point of view is useful, even those that are wrong. If we can judge why a wrong view was accepted. For example, we have found the casual self-deceptions of organics useful in analyzing your thought processes. Let's keep moving. Yes. They've seen us.
this should come in handy. seen here. This is a database. It contains a portion of the heretic's accumulated memories. Wait. We discovered copies of our current patrol routes in this database. This suggests the heretics have left times within our network. We wouldn't be here if the heretics wanted to be friends with the Geth. Why wouldn't they spy on you? You do not understand. Organics do not know each other's minds. Geth do. We are not suspicious. We accept each other. The heretics desired to leave. We understood their reasons. We allowed it. There was peace between us. The heretics were biding their time, waiting for an opportunity to attack you. If they reached this judgment before they left, we would have heard it in their thoughts. How could we have become so different? Why can we no longer understand each other? What did we do wrong? The flip side of freedom is responsibility. They made a bad choice. Let them own it. You're not responsible for their decisions. That argument is logical for an individual mind. We are not fully individuals. There are pieces of us in the heretics. One of those may be at fault. This topic is irrelevant. We must return to the mission. Have you reached a decision about whether to rewrite the heretics or not? We are still trying to build consensus. Some processes judge destruction preferable. Others rewrite. Let's keep moving. Yes. 